My name is Virtue Carlin. I, um, I've actually been at NIU for seven years because I got my undergraduate degree from here. Uh, it was a Bachelor of Science degree. And then I recently got my master's degree last uh, May. And now I'm working on my PhD. And my research involves um, big cat anatomy and then comparing it to extinct uh, felids. Uh, this lab I have started teaching last semester. Uh, before then, I was teaching Biology 357 class, which is an anatomy and physiology class. Uh, I've taught that class for about six semesters. It's a very hands-on experience. So in 357, we only work with plastic models. But so here, students have the advantage of looking at the, the real thing and learning from actual real bodies. We have about 12 cadavers right now. Um, the class that I'm TAing, we're only using two of them. Uh, the other cadavers we use for high school students. High school students like to come in and do spend a whole day looking at the, looking at the cadavers. And the others we're saving for the next, next semesters. But yeah, they are usually surprised, but also fascinated. Some have felt faint. Some actually have fainted and hit their heads. So this class was actually a dance studio, and that's why we have all these mirrors around this class. We always tell the students to treat the bodies with the utmost respect, because these people, uh, the people who have donated their bodies, were not just homeless people or you know people from mental hospitals, as some people think. So these are actually people who wanted to donate their bodies. They wanted to put their bodies to good use. Yeah, so we always tell the students to understand that and respect the bodies and never to make fun of anything.